the age of 18 and you are watching this video, please stop now. This content was not intended for you. Hey everybody, it's Tamika. I am back with group number six in the loaded die cut swap. If you haven't checked out group number five, please do so. I will have those links down below in the description box. Starting us out at number six is my girl Cheryl. You can find Cheryl at Jim's Isle here on YouTube, and this is how her packages come. She has them wrapped in clear bags. They all look decorated the same, except for the sentiment. Some very pretty holographic XOXO paper is under there. And then she has information on the swap and where you can find her on YouTube and Instagram. So thank you so much, Cheryl, for making me one. So let's get it open. This is the one that Cheryl created for me. So I am going to share with you guys the goodies that she sent. And these are some cute bags. You still have these, girl? I was looking for these. These are so adorable. So it has Paris and then there's a Fleur de Lis on the back. These are muslin drawstring bags. Thank you so much, lady. And ooh, she sent some mink tags. Oh, wow. These are so cute. So if you have, you use these, you add some foil, run it through your, um, I was going to say vellum machine, but it's a laminator. And then you have the cute little outcome. Super adorable. It's 21 pieces in that. And then, what are these? Card set? Oh, you have the same thing in the card set that you can foil. Can you foil the envelopes too? I'm curious. I've never seen this. Cute. That is neat. Thank you so much for these, lady. Really, really appreciate you guys and your generosity, as always. Um, this is her swap. She has um, constructed like a little book. Oh, look at this pretty satin paper. And she has a belly band that she has. This one has love. And then there's some pretty beautiful flowers. And then some a little um, some roses here or leaves and some roses. You can just take this belly band off. And again, she was on the live with me <laughs> while we were crafting with Audrey. And we did all this together. So <laughs> I know what's in here. <laughs> So I think this went on here like that and yeah, it did go on there like that, but I'm just going to take it off for the sake of the video and share with you guys what she has in these bags. This is a cute die set, um, tag die set with the holes, holes all around. How cute is that? Gold shimmer, beautiful, pretty shimmer and white. In each of the two sizes, or two each of the three sizes, small, medium, and large. And then in the same bag, she has this really pretty um, flourish. How cute is that? So adorable. And that's in white. Oh my goodness. I love this bow dye. It's so cute. Look at that. It's a matte gold how cute is that little center can go right there that is so pretty so dainty so elegant next she has this pretty oh my gosh how cute is that on the card or even even um, a back topper so adorable and she has it in this matte um she has three different kinds of gold there's this kind of um shimmer it's not shimmer it's a sheen maybe on this gold and then there's a matte kind of a gold and then there's this glitter gold so really cute and then she has this die oh she has cut out two of those cute you can use this again in on a paper edge or card edge and it's cut out in the same as that one really cute adorable all right so that is that pack so and that's how that open as a tri-fold. All right, so I'm going to open the second pocket here. We have some more tags, but these are cut out in pattern paper. And then she has these shapes. This one is stitched. You can layer that on top like that. How cute. In the same paper as that collection over there. And then she's cut out some words. Uh, happy birthday. And Thank you. Wait, I see it. Hold on. There it is. That's thank you. And then 
smile. Really pretty font. Just for you. And hello. Oh, they have the backs. Oh, awesome. So that's, that's what that looks like. So they have the shadows to it. Cute. Cute, cute. Oh, look at this one. How cute. Very pretty on a card. I mean, all these elements can be used on the card. You got this. You got a little swirly here. You can add your little happy birthday. Stick this on a card, and you're good to go. Thank you. Those are adorable. Look at these tiny little pillow box dies. Oh my gosh. And because you guys know me, I have to I have to see how tiny it is. It's so cute. Oh, look at it. This is how I get stuck with a uh hour long video that I have to try to edit down to somewhat of a reasonable number. Because I'm playing with the dice. Or I'm playing with something from the swap. Look how cute these are. So cute. Alright. I'm going to stop. And we're going to move on to the last little panel here. Those are so adorable. With that double sided paper. She has some larger happy birthdays. I mean, you got yourself another little card here, you know what I'm saying? These tags, oh, and she cut out so many. Looks like there's two each of, well, these, this has three. Three designs. It's like a scalloped square. And then this is so cute. I love this paper, this gold shimmer. And this folds over. Looks like there's a little score mark where you can fold that over. And it can be a cute little bag topper. How neat is that? And the last one she cut out in this pretty pink. Really cute. I wonder if that can lay on top of that. No, Tamika, that's doing the most. <laughs> but that's cute. That's the last one. It's over. And then that's her panels again. Of how she created. I have to put them all back together. But that's how that was folded. All like that with the cute little belly band on it, like such. So thank you so much, Cheryl, for playing. You guys can check her out at Jim's Isle. Next up is Kathy, and you can find Kathy at Canadian Scrapper Girl. This is how her packages come. But before I go into that, I have to give her a few hand claps. <laughs> because she ships from Canada, but she has a U.S. Um, mailing address for me to ship back to her. And if she was in the top, like, third percent of, not percent, but top third um, people of getting their package here, she was playing no game. She was like, I am coming from a long, long way away. I'm going to get this to her, and there's not going to be any problems. So thank you so much, Kathy, for being on it. I definitely appreciate that. So thank you so much. And this is how they come. So they're wrapped in clear bags. And then she has some cute tool and uh, a tag here that has a little heart on it, an XOXO foam uh, glitter sticker. And then on the back, she's uh, typed and printed out information on the swap. And again, her name is Kathy, Canadian Scrapper Girl. You can find her on Scrap Girl 2018 on Instagram. And she's listed the swap partners there as well. And that's the back. And they are all the same. And then also she's included a goodie bag in these cute little packages here. here. Uh, but that belongs to her. And I'm going to share with you what's inside these bags because Kathy created one for me. All right, this is what Kathy created for me. So I'm going to open up this cute little heart goodie bag here. Really pretty bag. That is so adorable. And in here she's included... Uh, some embellishment decorations. Oh, cute little iridescent pink heart sequin. Oh, they are so cute. That is really adorable. Love that. And she also has, oh wow, some a box of buttons. And you can even alter this wood box if you wanted to and or re-gift it. Such a cute idea. Really cute buttons in here. I've never seen that before. Of course, I don't live in Canada, so that could be the reason why. Um, really cute goodies, so thank you so much, Kathy, for that. 
And this is her swap. She has it in a loaded envelope style. And then, of course, it was around Valentine. It just was sent. So she has everything in this Valentine decor. So she has a little um, pick that she made. It's a shaker love. Cute. And I'm going to set this off to the side. I'm going to take this pick out too. A little fluffy heart. A foam red heart. And I think that's all the extras. Oh, wait. There's something else in here. Uh, oh, wow. Some nail files. Awesome. Thank you for that. Love these Emery boards. I need to do my nails. I had a little accident. Like scratches all on me. And I'm like, oh, I got to get it together. But I will be having my nails done here soon. Okay. Um, so I'm going to set this off to the side and just start pulling from this package so in this organza bag um she has a cute little heart banner oh it's double um you can use it either way you can you can use this either way it's two pieces how adorable is that that's adorable and then here's another one in pattern paper and then a banner and then I'm not sure what these are. Is this a tassel? It, there's a folded line here, but I'm not sure what this is. So maybe she's done a video, but there are three of them. It looks like there's a folded line in half, and then so maybe it's a tassel. So I'm not sure, but we'll figure it out. So that is cute. That is a really pretty heart die there and then she has a cute little topper with some decoration on it she has and she's backed up all of these with some pattern paper and so she has cut out some doilies and different um patterns or yeah different shapes in the same like um pattern in between all of them and then there's some stitched hearts and she's cut out some Polaroids in pink and white. I love making Polaroid shakers. Love those. And this is the next one. She has a banner. Um, what do you call this? Back topper. And then a doily and a little foam heart at the top. It's a really rich red. And then she has a... Um, oh, how cute is this? It's a tiny little bun bun box. <laughs> so adorable. This is a small die. Look at that. It'll go something like this. How cute. You can add a little Fair Rocher in there or something. How cute is that? And she sent some bag toppers. Cute. And then this shape. And then this heart shape. And this one. Which I think these are the same. Just two different colors. Cute. So now we're jumping into the middle of the box here. Let's move these out the way. She sent some stickers. These are so cute. I didn't ever saw these. They are so cute. Really, really fun. And I'm still sending out Galentine mail. So yes, girl, these are so adorable. I like this brand. These are, um, first of all, these are so cute. Let's just stop there. But they have the rose gold elements to it. And they're thick stickers. These are so cute. You don't have to just use these for Valentine. I love these. Thank you for that. I might still, I might still Cheryl's. She won't mind. Um, and then she has, oh my gosh, I want to go to Canada. It's not that far from me. This is so cute. Is this you guys' equivalent to like... Target or the Dollar Tree or something. Treat bags. These are treat bags with um, foil hearts. I love these so much. And, okay, so that was in the back. So let's get back to the dies. Thank you for these. I don't know if I said that or not. <laughs> Thank you for these. So this is how this is decorated. And she has some butterflies in here. So look at this cute silver die, it's silver shimmer glitter paper, so pretty. Oh wait, it has a back to it. So this is the die and then it has a shadow, cute, 
and so does these two really pretty or you can use them separately and then she sent out the little things in a die cut and then XOXO and then happy and love cute love this glitter paper so fine and I love it and then we have this package and then in this package um, it has two tags and then she has um, this die it's a um, wait this is a this goes on top of here like a little shaker maybe or just another little layer and then XOXO and then that tag so that's that and then she has tag toppers okay 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 so that can go there and then this can go on top of here like so and then she has some bag toppers oh here's another butterfly and then she has these butterfly oh wait this butterfly must go on here for the bag topper yeah so cute so that goes on there and then there's a bow bag topper and then she has the toppers for that here really cute and then the last thing in here she's created is oh wait it's two things in here I'll come back to that one like a little tag flip how cute and then she has a sequin pocket, a sequin um, heart fluff. So cute. One side sequin is silver, the other side is red. And then a heart charm. And then these little heart dangles everyone was looking for. And then it's decorated on a little cover. And these are tiny, tinier dies. So let's move these things around All right in this first I was looking for a good leaf punch to a leaf die she has some leaves cut out and that goes in the center some of the little cogs I think it's what it's called that die cute and let me move that over a little bit and then she has this heart with the arrow going through cut out in silver and pattern paper and then these hearts, this pocket is loaded. I'm trying to separate the two. So that one with the little mini hearts in there. And then this shape, look at all these cute, fun hearts. Oh, this is a beautiful paper. And then stitched, scalloped, stitched. This is a funky heart. Cute. I like this die. Cute. Like a little scribble heart and that was in the first um, pocket on the front and the back and then we have are these bunnies bunnies and this is cut out in two and white and then you get the silver one and then look at that pink one so cute and then this paper here pretty paper chocolate cover bunnies and then she has some chicks <laughs> and a deer. Cute. <laughs> so cute. All right. And then we're moving on to the next one here. Just cut out some flowers. Lots and lots of flowers. You can fold these over with your little tool, curl them up several ones that she has added and cute bows so she has this is one of my favorite dies cute and then she has this bow cut out in silver and then the same one in the pattern paper with hearts the last one here she has more flowers this was a long this is a large die it has a lot of pieces to it so it has several layers on here and it comes with the leaf I like these kind of dice because you can choose how big or how layered you want your flower 
So that came in that one and this shape, this one, a larger of that. My favorite, rolled roses. Cute. And that is the end of this tag flip. This is how all of them were packaged in these tiny little envelopes. All right, and then her last package here, she has some uh, gold elements. And oh my gosh, how cute is that bunny? How cute is that bunny in gold? It's my favorite accent color. Beautiful gold butterfly, a beautiful flower. She has the birds. Oh, cute. Let's put this down. She has a bee or two bees. Cute. And a little flower here. Adorable. Very, very nice. And then there's her tag flip. And that's it. This is her bag that she had that was loaded. So thank you so much, Kathy, for playing. You guys can check Kathy out at Canadian Scrapper Girl. Last but not least is Tracy. And you can find Tracy at Miss TLC1. And this is how her packages come. She has them wrapped in clear bags. And then she has this beautiful um, paper up here. And then it has uh, the information on the swap in this really cute little font there and everyone's name is listed on the top there really pretty paper I want to say this is a digital paper it's super cute really really pretty and they are all the same and Tracy created one for me so let's take a look this is the one that Tracy created for me super cute and she also has included a goodie here and it says cherish always that she has at the top of this clear bag cute my creative time stamp look how cute these are thank you so we are perfect matcha you are perfect you are the perfect i love you so matcha matcha best tea happy birthday i miss you love you oh this must go with a a stamp um like a tea stamp and then or die and then she has a little bitty um hearts hearts and stars how cute and then a flower cute stitch petals this is cute best tea <laughs> best tea <laughs> that's a cute little tea dye or you know that you could use really really cute thank you for that tracy and then this is her swap cute i like that she has this layered this must be a digital die cut she has all these little layers here and that's the back and this is magnet and then it opens oh cute cute look at all the prettiness that opens in here and this is a pretty big um pocket really large so i just want to share with you guys how it looks before i before i destroy the clear bags <laughs> so we're going to open up this one first and she has this is a really soft shabby paper she has the bows right here really pretty paper it's a pale blue and then some scalloped oh no that goes on top of the bag topper cute bag topper and then that goes on top of here she has two one for the front one for the back and then this die cute Oh my gosh, this gold is so pretty. I don't know why I love gold so much. Look at that. So cute. These butterflies are so pretty. You can even layer them. Cute. Love those. And then look at this one. Oh my gosh, such a pretty die. Look at these dies. They're so cute. I love it, Tracy. So, so cute. And then we'll move on to the next pocket. These dies are giving me tilde vibes. Seriously, they are. And let's see. She has, this is a tag. Or maybe it's an, oh, it adds onto here. You can add, it's a layer. So you can pop that up and add that to that. So there's two cut out in that. And this next set, see, doesn't this give you tilde vibes? 
It's cute. Little layers there. And this one. And then it has the out. I think I have this die. It's so pretty. I got to use it more. It's so cute. Love it. So one in the white and then one in the pattern. Really, really lovely. So soft. And then in the next pocket, we have a key, heart key and locket set. Very cute. And then this die, oh wow, this is so cute. This will be perfect on to put a little sentiment on top. And this middle pocket has one large pocket, or one large bag in it, and it has a bigger die, I can see. And she has some tickets, which some shapes, and I think they may go on top of here, or can, or maybe that's separate. But she has these shapes, and then this is a, this is that um, pocket little pocket die. How oh, cute. These things are so adorable. Just little doodads. How adorable. Oh. Oh, you can put that inside here. See what happens when you put stuff together? You're like, oh, that's what that's meant to do. See? These go in there. Ha! Ah, I would never know that until I put it together. And then she has another one. It's a library pocket. You can put this in there. Cute, Tracy. And then this one is an envelope pocket. Cute. I love it. I love that. Great idea. And then she has a larger one she's put together. And this has a, oh, it's a large one inside of a larger one. <laughs> so that's a pocket that goes with that. And then inside that was another little. Um, little pocket you could put together like that. So that's two. And then this one is a gable box. And there's two of them. <laughs> Love it. This is a really pretty paper. How cute is that? So soft. Did I say that already? I might have. All right. And in this pocket here. She has some gold shimmer paper. Oh my gosh, I love this swirl. Is that not the cutest? I'm going to move this white off because it's messing up my thing here. Look how cute that is. So adorable. Oh, look at this one. Oh, so cute. Oh, hold on. They're in an entanglement. It's such a dainty dye. It's so gorgeous. Look at that. So pretty. I love these. And then this one. How cute is that? Very, very cute, Tracy. And then she has a pocket, and this is all white paper. Oh, this is an emboss. Oh, this is embossed. Oh, is this um this is that um wood thing, the the wood circle, I believe. I think that's what this is. And it's embossed and cut out. Obviously, it's cut out, but it's embossed as well. And then look at these cute little feathers. Oh, my gosh. I love a feather and a leaf dye. It's embossed, too, as well. Cute. And then some rolled flowers. Very handy. And then in this pocket, let's see, there's something tiny and cute. So this is a cute die. Very nice. And then we have these two, like center dies for sentiments, and it comes with a piece little oval piece and this one comes with this piece you can stamp on very very lovely and that's the end that's her book 
with all of her elements in there. Again, this is how it looks emptied out. Very, very pretty. Very beautifully decorated. Thank you so much, Tracy, for participating. You guys can check Tracy out and all of her awesomeness at Miss TLC1. So Tracy wraps up the group. Of course, you guys can check Tracy out again at Miss TLC1. And this is what she created. Don't forget to check out Cheryl, who is Jim Zile. And this is what she created. I had to put them all in bags for now so that I can wrap up the video. And then don't forget Kathy, who is Canadian Scrapper Girl. And this is what she created. So thank you guys all so much for playing again. You guys check these ladies out. I will talk to you guys later. Bye.